Hi guys, this is Mike at netbooklife.com. We're going to take a quick look today at a nice leather case for the iPad 2. This one made by Snug. This is probably one of the most popular uh, such leather folios available right now. It's quite popular in the US and in Europe as well. It's available in UK, in Germany and pretty much all the big markets and you can find it on Amazon. It goes for to $29 in the US and for £29 in the UK. So pretty nice uh, case we have it right here this is the black version I believe it comes in a couple of other color options as well you can see that the exterior is made from leather so it's quite nice it's quite uh, quite reliable it's uh, definitely not uh, one of those cheap cases it has the snog logo here on the case and on the back let's take a quick look on the back you get this flap where uh, it's, uh, it's used for uh, for setting uh, the device uh, uh, with uh, like this it acts like this acts like a stand this case also acts like a stand and you can set it like this or like this for typing I'm going to show you that in a couple of moments when I get my iPad inside and you also have a couple of holes for the speakers here and for the camera while on the front you also have this place for the button the click button and another hole here on top for the click for the front facing camera uh, interior is padded in some material looks like velvet or suede or something like this feels very nice and it's going to protect your device quite uh, nicely and this is the compartment we're going to store the the iPad you can see it comes with a velcro closure so uh, your device won't uh, won't get loose in there and of course you have contrasting stitching in white on this one and they look uh, quite nice as well and here you have an, uh, an armband you can use when carrying the device I'm going to show you uh, more details about it in a couple of minutes but uh, now let's uh, let's slide in the the iPad 2 we have it here this is the black version as you can probably see okay it goes like this it's actually very easy to get in just slide it in here and it is right now aligned and just close the, vel the velcro closure here like this and this is pretty much all you can see that the, the casing is pretty uh, snug in here it's not loose actually works quite nice and you can see that there's the button here and the camera on top and you also have a place for the camera on the back so everything looks quite nice you also get access to your port this is the charging port the speakers here these are the lock button and the volume rockers and this is here access gets access here for to headset and the, microphone and this uh, uh, screen locking uh, button as well okay and as you can see this uh, case doesn't add a lot of bulk to the device still makes it quite uh, quite bulky because the interior the suede interior is quite thick so it will be protective feels like a very solid case I really like it I've been using it for a while for a couple of weeks now and it's been quite nice okay and let me show you how you can turn it into a stand it goes like this and you can put your iPod like this and you can watch some movies or something like this or you can have it like this for typing and you're going to easily type like this if you want to write something while using it at your desk uh, what I also like about this uh, is that it comes with magnetic flop you can see that it flops it has magnets here here and here and it's actually quite nice and it, it will automatically turn off the iPad when closed so it feels pretty solid okay and I'm going to compare this one right now with another case it's a cheaper case this is the case I, use, I used before this one goes for a third of the price of this one and on first look basis it looks the same made from leather both made from leather this one doesn't come with, with contrasting stitches you can see they add a little bit of style to this one but everything else is pretty much the same however you'll notice that the interior on this one definitely feels poorer than the interior on this one 
this one is way better it's thicker and feels nicer well this one is not that not that good and uh, also the velcro closure on this one is a little bit poorer and the device is a little bit uh, it's a, a little bit loose while while getting it inside so this is why i rather have this case uh, the spider that it is uh, it is actually more expensive 30 bucks when compared to this one which goes for like 10 bucks uh, I really like this one feels more solid and uh, uh, higher quality also like this part here the, the margins on this one they already started to peel off after a couple of uh, after a couple of weeks of using it but this one actually looks more solid and I believe it will be quite reliable I'll have it for a while okay well, let's take a quick look at this thing here not really a fan of it it's a, a band an armband totally you should get put your iPad like this and you can easily hold it like this it feels more secure or it, you can use it when trying to to use FaceTime you can hold it like this definitely feel quite quite nice but it's not really a feature I'm using on this one I would rather have here some kind of pocket a slim pocket where I could put uh, some kind of cleaning cloth for the screen of my iPad that would have been actually nicer and I'm also going to show you another matching accessory that works with this one I yeah, have it right here and this is it also made from snug uh, by snug and it is actually a headset mount you can get this in your car and get on the headset of your uh, front seats and then you can put uh, the, the iPad uh, and uh, face it towards uh, the passengers uh, in the back and they can watch some clips or stuff like this it's fairly easy to install this part goes around the headrest comes with an elastic band it's quite easy to get in and then you'll just have to slide in the case like this you see it's it doesn't get in that easy that's nice because it's going to hold it in place okay it should go like this okay something like this so this one goes around the headrest and then the iPad will get on the back like this it will to stay like this something like this on the back of your uh, uh, chair and the kids on the back or anyone else can easily watch some uh, content on it they can watch for instance I don't know some clips or surf the web or stuff like this so it's pretty nice accessory especially if you need something like this I don't really use it because I don't have any kids so nobody is going to watch uh, uh, to use the iPad uh, in the back of my car but still it's pretty nice and it goes for 25 bucks as well in the US 25 euros in uh, in the UK so if you want if you need such an accessory uh, iPad uh, head rest mount this is a pretty solid option it's actually quite cheap and comes with very good reviews okay so this is uh, all this was all with my uh, with this line of uh, iPad 2 accessories uh, I have a bunch of different cases and this is the one I use right now I'm not saying it's the best but it's definitely one uh, with a very good price over features ratio it's quite reliable and looks quite solid this is why I recommend it you can find uh, you can find it on Amazon and uh, there's also there are also links uh, in the description below uh, below in this clip uh, to places where you can actually buy it um, and uh, towards the written review on the side we're also going to find a couple of extra pictures with this uh, iPad uh, leather folio case and stand okay thank you that was Mike on edbooklive.com with the snug leather iPad case uh, accessory thank you